How many of you have the pattern? You send a text message. You don't tell the person, you have five minutes or less to get back to me. <laughs> they take their time, which is their time, to text you back, and then you don't get a message back, and you blow up their phone six, seven, eight, twenty times. Then 20 minutes later, they reach out to you going, oh, my phone is off. I was away from it. And like, what's going on? Is there an emergency? See, that's one of the biggest patterns that we've created that we don't even know why. How many of you have ever created an expectation for another human being? Raise your hand. Half of you are liars. <laughs> Everyone does it. Your mind just said, no, I don't. That's fine. How many of you have created an expectation for another human being? Comma. Never shared the expectation with them. So when they don't fulfill the expectation that they know nothing about, who do you get upset at? Them. How does that make any sense to even an average intelligent person? And we do it all the time. Listen, there's nothing wrong with what you've been doing because you're not aware of what you've been doing. Can I just borrow a helper from the crowd? All you have to do is sit. I need someone to raise your hand. Okay, oh, they lady over there. Okay, cool. Ready? Yeah, you. Okay. I'm going to... It's still you. Okay, there you go. Awesome. Me? I want to be the star. Okay. So I'm going to do what we do as human beings all the time. Ready? Here we go. Why didn't you do it? What's wrong with you? You just made me mad. Okay, so what I did was I created an expectation for her to stand up, go YMCA, <laughs> and sit back down. Did I tell her the expectation? Is there any way that she would have known what I wanted her to do? Do I have any right as a human being to be upset at her? Then why do you do it all the time with every person in your life? 